crazy. We're going to do some Reiki for some relaxation. And I'm going to begin by lighting some sage just to get our aura nice and relaxed. Thank you, Yogi. Thank you. And we're just lighting the sage to create a safe space for our energy to help us unwind and get nice and relaxed. Thank you so much. Here we go. To accept this Reiki, all you have to do is consent or accept, be willing and open. And if you don't, that's okay. You won't receive Reiki energy, but you still may find this very relaxing. And so I'm just putting some lavender on my hands to help with creating. Thank you, Didi. Thank you. There we go. So I'm just combing through that aura right now. Hi, Miss Susie Q. It's so good to see you Ria, thank you so much. Thank you, Ria. Thank you. Thank you, Ria. Thank you to Nora. Ash, thank you. Thank you so much. Thank you, Marla. Thank you. Thank you, Marla. Thank you, Miss Susie Q. Thank you, Tara. Thank you, everybody. Right now I'm just working in that aura. Thank you, Yogi Bay. Thank you. Thank you, Joanne. We're just working on creating balance, releasing, relaxing, letting go of any anxiety. Thank you. We're just releasing stress, letting go. Thank you, Miss Susie Q. Thank you so much. Thank you, Miss Susie Q. Thank you. Oh, thank you. Thank you, Ria. It's beautiful. Thank you so much, Ria. Thank you, Ria. There we go. I'm going to do some plucking in that aura. 
Right now, I'm plugging, removing any heavy energies, just releasing and letting those go. Thank you, Dees. Thank you, Tees. Let it go. Thank you guys for all that light. There we go. Just release. Letting it settle. There you go. I'm going to do some more plucking in that aura. Thank you. Thank you. We're just balancing, finding that inner peace, connecting with our energy right now. Since we will be working on releasing um, any anxiety, and since we are working on uh, working with symptoms of depression, thank you, Lindsay. What I would like to do is do a chakra uh, cleanse, just purging the energy from the root up and letting it exit the crown. And so we are going to start with our root chakra now, and that is right at that base of that spine. Thank you, Rhea. And we're just going to just take a moment here and really allow ourselves to get grounded and stabilized. Your root chakra holds your stability, your grounding, and whenever you feel like any of your primal instincts are uh, in any kind of danger, if there's any major losses going on, this can cause a significant amount of anxiety and so we're just working on stabilizing that energy right now and going to do a little plugging do that plucking, I would like to do a guided meditation with you. This guided meditation will just be a body scan, just settling that energy, settling the body, the physical body in your mind, and resting your spirit right now. Go ahead and just scan your body from head to toe. And as 
as you scan your body, let's just scan it for any heavy feelings, any heavy emotions, scanning it for any tension, any pain in the body. Just take a nice deep breath in and just imagine that energy traveling right to that area that may feel just a little uncomfortable. And on the exhale, let's just release and just imagine any pain just exiting the body out through the breath. Inhaling again. Now I would like you to just tighten up all the muscles on your body. Tightening them up. And just evaluating your body, evaluating your head, evaluating your neck, your shoulders, your feet, your abdomen, the temperature, is it hot, is it cool in your body, are you experiencing any sensations? So taking those breaths in and then exhaling, there you go. Now let's take your attention to your head, to your face, to your eyes, to your scalp, to your neck the back of your head and let's release those muscles right now keeping the rest of your body nice and tight just letting your whole face relax right now letting your head relax let's take your attention to your neck to your shoulders, to your collarbone, the back of your shoulder blades, very good. Now let's just release those muscles, keeping everything else nice and tight. Just allowing those muscles to become very heavy and very relaxed. your attention now to your shoulders, to your biceps, to your chest, to the back of your arms, there you go, to your shoulder blades. And let's release those muscles, keeping Everything else. Now let's take your attention to your rib cage. Take your attention to your mid back. Coming nice and heavy, nice and relaxed. Now please take your attention to your arms, to your forearms, your wrists, your palms, your fingertips, and release those muscles. And now we're going to take your attention to your lower back and to your abdomen, 
and right under your navel and now on your hips and let's release those muscles And now taking your attention to your thighs, to your hamstrings, to your kneecaps, to the back of your knees, and now down your calves. On your shins. There you go. And let's release those muscles, really grounding you in. And now focusing on your feet, the tops of your feet, and the soles of your feet. And now your ankles. Exhale now, just scanning your body again, letting your body become so heavy from head to toe. Releasing and letting go of any tension now, giving up any hold, just allowing your body to be so deeply relaxed, so absorbed in this moment. And now I'm going to do some plucking on that root chakra, just removing any heavy energy, anything that's blocking you from feeling stable. Letting go of any irritabilities, letting go of instabilities I'm going to use a chakra wand. Thank you, Chrissy. Thank you, Vami. 
Here we go. Taking a nice deep breath in. Really connecting with your energy. Letting your whole body just float right down with the softness and the pureness, the purity of that energy. Here we go. Just imagining a beautiful outline of energy just floating your whole body. And connecting with that root chakra right now. Here you go. Good job. I'm going to move to that. Thank you, Lisa. Move to the sacral chakra. And as I move to the sacral, I'm going to use some selenite on that. And I want to let anybody know that it's joining in. We are doing Reiki. Um, and we are beginning with the root, moving up the chakras purging out any unwanted heavy energies. If you haven't followed me yet, please give me a follow. If you enjoy this, um, I do guided meditations for subscriber only on Tuesdays and Thursdays. I would love for you to subscribe to me. It's $5.99. There's a little star up there that can help you get to that. If you hit that star, um, if you want to just see what comes along with the subscriber slides, uh, what the perks are, that will show you too. And I have a goal to get 10, a personal goal, so to end with 6.15 tonight. So if you want to help me achieve that goal and support me as a creator, I would truly appreciate that support. Ah, that's the support. There we go. Right now I'm right on that sacral chakra and we're working on aligning the sacral. We are working on emotional wellness and tonight since we are doing a Reiki for anxiety and depression just going to really work on balancing out that emotional energy. Here we go. Working on the sacral is also very good for fertility. Thank you, Stephanie. Thank you. Thank you so much. I appreciate that. Um, and it is also good for working on uh, addiction too. Thank you so much. Thank you, Stephanie. Thank you for being here. And so we're just balancing out that energy right now. Here we go. Thank you.
I'm going to use that selenite to just balance out this energy. Selenite's very good for protecting energy and removing negative energy too. And when you work on that sacral chakra and you are balancing out your own emotions, then you have the ability to also help others with balancing their emotions too. Um, usually when you have a positive vibration and you're on a higher vibration, you tend to bring that energy up in a room, balancing everybody out. And so, it's a really nice feeling when you're able to do that. Uh, and you're never responsible for somebody else's emotions or how they feel. Um, but our energy is very, very infectious around others, and so it may just be helpful. There you go. And if you're working on the sacral for um, addiction, how that helps with that is it helps with curbing cravings, um, reducing stress, and just releasing obsession.
And so just taking the time to really allow yourself to balance out these emotions. Thank you, Dragon. And we will begin working on that sacral. Thank you, Jason. Our solar plexus. And we are moving up to the solar plexus. So when we move up to that, we are moving right up to that earth cage. Thank you, Ella. And you can just imagine this yellow wheel just spinning around inside you, holding confidence, holding inner strength. Um, releasing, letting go of any kind of childhood trauma right now and we're just going to really connect with feeling carefree and just connecting with our confidence again our self-worth And it's a good time to just remind yourself I am worth a lot and what makes you worth so much what is that special quality that you have are you funny are you kind are you smart are you thoughtful loving, intellectual, athletic, driven, thank you. Everybody has a special quality and it's just so important to remind yourself that you are worth a lot because you are here today on this universe. Thank you, Amanda. Thank you, Angelina. Thank you. sometimes when it's difficult to find what you feel gives you self-worth is thinking of maybe something that your friends say and that could be that you are such a thoughtful caring person or you make me smile just telling yourself, reminding yourself of those things then. Thank you, Ms. Hoya. But everybody has value and very important value. And if you doubt that, I'm telling you that you definitely have value. I was told something when I was in depression and I was feeling very sad or defeated and somebody said to me and it meant so much to me and I'm very spiritual so they said God but you could say life, you could say the universe, whatever um, your greater being is um, but they would tell me all the time they would be like 
God did not bring you this far to have you drop. And I would think about that and it meant so much to me. And even when I didn't have faith, like it, um, that was something that really stood out to me. And I think that could resonate with a lot of people is the universe, life, God, whatever you call it would not bring you here this far today at this very moment wherever you are if you're lying in bed if you're laying on the couch if you're at work or if you're you know just feeling defeated you would not get this far if, if you weren't meant to be here thank you angelina and so i think that's so important to now to remember, thank you, Mrs. R. And so important to share with any of your friends that may be feeling defeated. Thank you, Laura. Thank you so much. And just remembering that every day that we have here is such a beautiful, special gift. Such a beautiful, special gift. Thank you, Francisco. Even if it's a day that we feel like we've wasted because we've just laid in bed all day. And laying in bed can be really good self-care. And laying in bed still gets you one day closer to whatever you're manifesting in life, whatever your dreams are, and one day gets you one more beautiful day with spending time with the people that you love or thinking about the people that you love. Just becoming excited again about the journey, excited about yourself and who you are, the strength that you have, the unique individual that you are. Thank you, Chrissy. There we go. I'm working on the solar plexus, just releasing any self-doubt, releasing Letting go of anything that's blocking your confidence. There you go.
Okay, I'm gonna put some more lavender on my hands and if you haven't subscribed yet, if you find this relaxing or if you are up for renewal for subscribing, I have a goal, a personal goal to try to get 10 more subscribers tonight um, to achieve that. So I'd appreciate it. It is $5.99. I, with the $5.99, I have subscriber only lives that I do guided meditation. And when I do the guided meditation for January, we've been working on manifestation meditations. And those are on Tuesdays and Thursday mornings. And I also have um, two inner child healings. So those will be January 14th and January 17th. Thank you, Deez Beats. Um, so if you are interested in any of that, if any of that's part of a new year habit that you want to incorporate, uh, it's only $5.99 two times a week for the guided meditation. Um, and yeah, if you hit the little star up in the left-hand corner, it will also show you what those subscriber benefits look like. So I need 10 more people to subscribe to me to help me achieve that personal goal tonight. And I would appreciate that. Thank you, Anne. That's beautiful. And then, yeah. Oh, thank you, Liz Pepper. It's good to see you today. Thank you. Thank you so much. Thank you. Thank you, Lori. Thank you, Liz Pepper. All right. And so, hi, thank you, Angelina. So we're going to move to that heart chakra. Oh, thank you, Clapton. Thank you for resubscribing. I appreciate that. Thank you for helping me get closer to my goal. Thank you. Thank you so much. Now I only need nine people to subscribe to me to get to that personal goal tonight. Thank you, Clapton, for helping me get closer. heart chakra now and working on that heart chakra we are working on releasing any heartache releasing any heavy energies any pain to the heart letting go of grief letting go of loss and you won't completely let go of grief and loss but what it might do is just alleviate the pain Reducing it a little right now. If you're just joining in tonight, we are doing Reiki to help with relaxation, also to help with symptoms of depression and anxiety. There you go. And then I will be back on on Sunday to do sleepy time Reiki Sunday evening and I'll probably be back on in the daytime on Sunday too
going to take a nice long deep breath in and gently relaxing your face, relaxing your neck, relaxing your chest, your shoulders, your whole body, letting it become so heavy and so deeply relaxed now. Releasing, letting go of heavy energies, breathing in healing energy right now, recharging and resetting your body, resetting that energy in it. And every breath in is so healing, so refreshing, resetting and recharging. Inhaling again, nice and big, breathing in a beautiful green energy and letting it travel to your heart. Resetting, recharging, and healing. And on the exhale, let's release and let go of any heavy pain, just letting it go. Inhaling again, breathing in that beautiful green energy, let it travel to your heart. Healing, recharging, resetting. Exhale, release any heaviness, release sadness, release pain, let it go. Inhaling again, breathing in that beautiful green energy. Healing, recharging, resetting, release, letting go of pain, letting go of sadness, letting go of heaviness. Inhaling again, breathing in that beautiful green energy, let it travel to your heart. Healing, recharging, resetting. And I Again, breathing in that beautiful green energy, so healthy, so strong, so loving, and so kind. And exhale and release and let go, letting go of that beautiful green energy within is so loving, so kind, and so strong and healthy. that beautiful green energy traveling around you like a beautiful hug of energy all around your body inhale again breathing in that beautiful green energy so healthy so strong so loving and kind you exhale and you watch that energy just traveling around the universe coming from you it's so loving so kind so healthy and so strong there you are just like that this next inhale you feel that loving kind energy just beaming from your chest. You imagine it intertwining with the sun rays. The sun just continues to recharge that heart with so much strength, so much loving and kind 
Thank you, Chrissy. Thank you for resubscribing. I appreciate that. Thank you, Marissa. Thank you, Holly. I'm looking for nine more subscribers to achieve that subscriber goal. Thank you guys for helping me get closer to that today. Thank you M1M for resubscribing. I appreciate that. Thank you so much. Thank you. Thank you for helping me get closer to my goal. Thank you, Red Erica. Thank you everybody that's sharing this live. I see that. Thank you so much. And thank you for all of those likes. I appreciate it. And I see a lot of you giving me a follow. So thank you for joining and following. I appreciate that. Thank you, Stitches. I'm going to use a selenite on that, um, on that heart chakra. Let's see. Oh, thank you, Stephanie. I appreciate that. Thank you so much. And so I have this selenite. Um, I don't know where my large selenite is, but that's okay. I love this one anyway. There we go. And we're just purifying and protecting that chakra, that heart center energy right now. Just always knowing that love, love and kindness that's what we're made of, that's what we're born with, our original energy, and just really connecting with that. Thank you, Stitches. There we go. Thank you, Sunstar.
you. Thank you, Rachel, for resubscribing. I appreciate that. Thank you for helping me get closer to my subscriber goal, too. Thank you, Lolly. Uh, I only need eight more people to achieve that subscriber goal. Thank you, guys. Thank you for helping me get there tonight. I appreciate it. going to move to that throat chakra now and our throat chakra we are working on self-expression and we are working on just releasing and letting go and I keep trying to tap but I cut my nails a little too short this time and so the tapping's not working tonight I'm just using the Sodalite crystal to help with uh, just removing any of those energies that are blocking our communication, anything that's getting in the way of setting healthy boundaries. We're just releasing and letting those go. Thank you, Stitches. I'm going to do a little cord cutting there. When I do the cord cutting, we're just removing still more anything that's kind of wrapped around energy cords that are wrapped around that throat chakra. Um, sometimes people may uh, get a little itchy in the throat. Sometimes you might cry. Uh, when you're able to unblock the throat chakra just because of expressing bottled up emotions or being ready to, um, you may see your boundary setting impro um, improve. You might find yourself really setting and establishing very healthy, assertive boundaries with people in your life, saying no more often, not over committing, um, when you're able to do that, you ha tend to have a lot less resentments that you hold on to, uh, you find yourself having more time for self-care, recharging, resetting your energy. And really centering that inner peace. There we go. Thank 
Thank you, Rachel. Thank you so much. Thank you, Rachel. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you, Rachel. Thank you, Rachel. I appreciate those hearts. Thank you so much. There we go. Poor Jess. Really getting in there. In that throat chakra. And I do want to remind the subscribers, all of those guided meditations will be back at the normal time. Um, I appreciate you all joining in early. Thank you, Robert. Thank you so much for subscribing. I will give you a follow when this live is done. You'll also have access to all of those subscriber only lives, the guided meditations and those two inner child healings that we're going to do in the month of January. Thank you so much, Robert, for helping me get closer to my goal. I only need seven more people now to hit that personal goal tonight. Thank you. Um, but I was going to say to visit those um, guided meditations will be at 9 a.m. Tuesday and Thursday. Uh, Mountain Standard Time. Thank you, Robert. And I'm super excited. We've been working on manifestation meditations for January. Just getting set for the new year. The excitement. The excitement to really get closer to the life that we are manifesting, but also enjoying the process of it. Enjoying every bit, every part of that process. It's so important. Thank you, Stitches. And it's really important to validate and congratulate yourself when you're taking those steps closer to your manifestation, even when things are hard. Thank you, Marissa. Um, thank you. Today was a big step for me for one of my uh, life goals is to uh, help people and I do that for a living but today I had uh, my last day at my job of eight years and it was a very fulfilling job but I just had a better opportunity come along that I've been working on and I really have to thank you Marla I really have to clap and congratulate myself for getting to where I'm at, you know, and everything, um, but also and in, in enjoying the process, but it doesn't make it like any easier to walk away from something that I found so fulfilling in life. And so, um, but that's part of the transformation, part of the growth and enjoying the process. So, and even though in the process can be sad, but in a good way, um, you know, it's still, it still makes it, you know, um, like it's one of those things that I know that, you know, it's, it's for the good. It's definitely for the good, but I think that it's so important to take those moments to really 
think about like the things that you learn, the things, the stepping stones that you take in life. And sometimes they're so hard and so difficult, but it's, you know, when you're being guided, it's so important to, to just thank the process. Thank you, Miranda. Thank you so much. I appreciate you subscribing. Thank you for helping me get closer to my goal. I will give you a follow when this live is done. You'll also have access to those subscriber-only uh, benefits. Thank you so much. Thank you, Lavina. Thank you, Miranda, for helping me get closer to my goal. I only need six more people. Hi, Storm. It's good to see you. Thank you, Starfire. Thank you, Han. Thank you so much. Thank you, Ivan. Thank you, Brandy. Thank you so much for subscribing. I appreciate that. I will give you a follow when this live is done. You'll also have access to all those subscriber-only guided meditations. Thank you so much. I appreciate you helping me get closer to my goal tonight. Thank you, Brandy. I only need five more people now to subscribe to help me get to that personal goal. Thank you, everybody, for being here tonight. Thank you for all of the support. Thank you. Thank you, Evergreen. Thank you so much for subscribing. I appreciate that. You're getting me closer to my goal. I will give you a follow when this live is done. You'll also have access to those subscriber-only guided meditations, and you'll have access to, um, to the two inner child healing that we have this month. Thank you so much. And now I only have four more people that I need to subscribe to me to help me achieve that goal. Thank you so much, Evergreen, for helping me get closer to that. There we go. And let's go ahead and take it now to our third eye. Third eye, connecting with that intuition, connecting with your inner voice. And I'm going to use the chakra wand to help align this one. There we go. So we're going to do some plucking on this one and let's see how to put together a quick thank you Kathy thank you so much let's see um Sorry guys, I'm just putting together a real quick poll. This is for the subscribers and um, these times would be for uh, Mountain Standard Times. Um, not 1 a.m., let's see. All right, 
So I just put a poll up, and that is for the subscribers, because Sunday mornings, not this Sunday, but next Sunday, I'll be able to start adding Sunday morning friends who are guided meditations. So I just want to see, and those are for Mountain Standard Times, but once I get the majority, I'm going to add that to the subscription. Thank you, Lisa. And it, it helps you out with time. Right now it's 8.15 Mountain Standard Arizona time. I'm working on that third eye chakra now. Just working on really connecting with your intuition and just allowing that intuition to guide you. Letting your eyes become nice and heavy now, nice and relaxed. Letting your face become so sleepy. Let's go ahead and take it to your crown chakra now, right over your scalp. Just really taking some time to connect with spirituality, releasing, letting go of any worry, letting go of any anxiety, releasing any Racing thoughts. Here we go. Just really purging out any last bit of heavy energy, just releasing it through the crown.
6, so 10 a.m. Mountain Standard Time. Letting your eyes get so nice and heavy right now. Letting your jaw relax. I'm going to use the wand and then put the, the comments on so I can say goodnight to everybody. Uh, next Friday night I will be doing um, the tarot pull cards again before I go live. That was really fun. I enjoyed that. And thank you guys. I see a lot of people following me tonight. Thank you so much. I appreciate it. Hi, Natoya. Thank you, Natoya. I'm still looking for four more subscribers. Thank you, Astral. Thank you. Thank you, Vicky. Thank you, Singing Chick. Yay! How exciting. Thank you for ordering one. Hi, Agnes. Thank you, Robert. Thank you for subscribing. Thank you, Mind, Body, Nourish. Thank you, Sharon. Hi, Bree. It's good to see you tonight. Thank you, Singing Chick. Hi, NSV. Thank you, Sunset. Thank you, Colleen. Aw. Thank you. Hi, Tara. Oh, Thank you, Milan. Thank you. Oh, I'm so glad, Natoya. Thank you, Agnes. Thank you, Tara. Thank you. Oh, thank you, Marla. Thank you, DCs. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you, Marla. Thank you, Lolly. Thank you so much. So, 10 a.m. Mountain Standard Time. Thank you, Kathy. Thank you so much. Thank you, Natoya. So, um, it won't start this weekend, though. It will start next weekend. Thank you, SF. Thank you, Bossy. Aw. Thank you, Stephanie. Thank you. Thank you, Chrissy. Thank you so much. Thank you, Ian. All right, and I'm going to do a little plucking before. Aw, awesome. Yes, thank you, Natoya. Thank you, Agnes. Aw, that makes me feel so happy. Twisted bubble gum. Thank you, Agnes. Thank you, Lavinia. Oh, thank you, Ramina. Thank you, Namaste, Winston. All right. Thank you, Marlena. <laughs> thank you, Agnes. 
Thank you so much. That makes me so happy. <laughs> Thank you, Romney. Thank you. I'm glad that you're here. Don't work too hard. Thank you, Erica. Thank you, Frankie, for following me. Thank you for ever, all the new followers. Thank you, Chris Cross. Thank you, Canopy. Thank you, Better. Oh, it's good to see you. I saw your video the other day. I loved it. Thank you, Shiny. You're healing. Please, everybody, give Agnes a following. She's my one of my moderators. Oh, yay. Thank you, Ian. Thank you so much for subscribing. I truly appreciate that. I'm only three more away from getting my personal goal. Oh, thank you, Stitches. That means so much to me. Thank you. Thank you. Oh, I'm sure it is. Thank you, Ian, for helping me get closer to my goal. I'll give you a follow when this live is done. You'll also have access. Oh, thank you, Lindsay. That means so much to me. Oh, that means so much to me. Thank you, Stephanie, for trusting me with that. I love doing tarot. Uh, Thank you so much, Agnes. Thank you, Teresa. Yes, uh, so that really means a lot to me, um, Lindsay, because I actually have been turning um, TikTok and thank you, Stephanie. That means so much to me. I love the feedback, you guys to hear that um means a lot to me because i um am doing tiktok and teaching my school my online school and i was i took a very uh big leap this hi from brazil thank you oh thank you so much um so i took a very big leap i have been doing a lot like working on TikTok, working on my online school and doing my life coaching to the point that I probably have been um, working about probably over 70 hours a week this last year and so um, but TikTok has been working out very well for me. Hi Nina! Oh my goodness! Nina is one of my, my uh, former co-workers today we were still co-workers thank you nina for being here thank you you're so sweet and so um and i'm definitely gonna have her on a live one night uh and so anyway this really means a lot to me um and because i i left like a job that i love so much but that it was it was time to to move to my next part of my journey and I appreciate everybody here on TikTok uh, opening up your hearts to me. Yes, thank you so much. Thank you so much, Storm. That means so much to me. Thank you. And yeah, so it just kind of was a better move for me to to put down the other job um, and and do this. Uh, but yeah, it's, I don't know. Yes. <laughs> I love that last, the last pranks. Yes. <laughs> you know what I told my kids? I said, you guys are, um, you guys are my new coworkers now and they see all the mess that I caused at my work and they were like, please don't bring that home to us. <laughs> so <laughs> thank you so much, Junora. Thank you. <laughs> that makes me happy that you guys enjoy my pranks. <laughs> oh, can everybody send uh, send prayers to Renuko? <laughs> Thank you, everybody, for being here tonight. Thank you. Yes, the pranks will continue at home, Nina. <laughs> 
Did your daughter have the bait? She did. Oh my goodness. He's so handsome. He's four months old today or yesterday. Thank you, The Real. Thank you. Thank you, guys. Hi, Natoya. Thank you, guys. So, yes. So, I will get more grandma time in, too, now. Um, yes. I will have to uh, post another video of him soon. One of the infant Reiki's. Thank you, Agnes. Thank you so much. All right, guys. So we're going to end with our Reiki principles. Um, Reiki, do you have a new... Yeah, so I actually will have a new schedule. So I'm going to put that together this weekend. And then I'll put that up when the schedule will be uh, more days and times that I'll have available when I come to do Reiki online. Um, I'm trying to, well, that one, we're going to get a Sunday in now for the subscribers for guided meditation. And then uh, I really appreciate you, Nora, taking the time to see what everybody was interested in having for healing. She wrote down everything for me. So now I'm going to take the time to really put together a schedule. I'll pin it and I'll let you guys know when I pin it to my page so then you guys can see and if that sounds like a healing that you're interested in. Also, I love the feedback when you guys are sending me messages. I, you guys are, I mean, you guys, this is why I come here to do this and healing's very important to me and your guys' needs are very important to me. I take it very seriously. So send me a message if there's something that you would like to see, um, but also give me a little bit of time to, to put together that schedule because it might already be coming too. But as soon as I let you know and if you don't see it on there, then send me some feedback. And please everybody thank you, Nora Adventures for me. Um, she's so amazing. I really can't, like, I, I, I couldn't do this without her. She does such an amazing job with the chat. She's just so, uh, thank you guys. Um, she's just so kind, so sweet, so warm. She keeps it such a safe place and, um, really, like, I've seen other, other TikToks and the way that with, True, uh, creators get treated like I'm very blessed because she does so much um, that I don't I don't see any of that I don't I don't see the ugly side of TikTok because of her so um, I'm really grateful uh, that that we crossed paths that she actually offered to be my moderator one night because I did have a couple of people and I didn't know what to do so yeah thank you so much junora ashley i really like i said i i owe a lot to you um and you keep it like when you have the chats going the way that they're going and there's that that gives me a chance to to do the healing and stuff and and it's healing that you're doing too you really hear and you see every single person that's in that chat and you take the time to to give them support if support's needed. So thank you so much. I really appreciate you. So, all right guys, well, I'm gonna go, I'm gonna go get some sleep. Tomorrow I will be going on a date with my husband. He's taking me out to celebrate and yeah. <laughs> if... Oh my goodness, yes. I would love that. I would love that. Thank you so much. I truly appreciate that, Stephanie. Thank you. Aw, thank you guys. Thank you. I will. <laughs> it will be nice to spend some time with him. He hasn't seen me for a very long time working 70 hours a week. Aw, thank you. Thank you guys. All right. So yes, I want to add Stephanie, I'm going to add you on as a moderator then. Thank you so much. I appreciate that. And then, um, let's see. And then let's go ahead and do our Reiki principles tonight. And then I'm going to get some rest, guys. And I hope that you all have a beautiful evening. Please uh, don't hesitate to send me a message. Uh, 
if you have any other healing needs too. Thank you guys. Thank you. Thank you so much. Oh, I know. Yes. I will be talking about grandson time all the time. <laughs> all right. Please repeat after me, guys. Just for today, I will not worry. Just for today, I will not anger. Just for today, I will live in gratitude. Just for today, I will work honestly. And just for today, I will be kind to all living creatures. Namaste. Namaste. You guys all have a beautiful evening. Thank you again. Thank you so much. And thank you, June, Nora, Ashley. And thank you, Agnes and Stephanie. Thank you guys. Namaste, Natoya. Good night, guys. Sleep tight. Sweet dreams. Thank you, Stardust.